Hello everybody, brothers and sisters in Christ. My name is Susanna David. I am happy to come your way again to share the word of the Lord with you. Today is December 2, 2017. I had a revelation yesterday. It is about the judgment of the Lord that is coming upon the world and all the inhabitants of this earth. It was in the evening of yesterday. God gave me this vision. I had a revelation yesterday and this is, this is what the Lord revealed to me. Uh, in the revelation, I saw flames of fire rolling up like this, just fire rumbling. And then I heard a voice of the Lord saying to me that if I destroy Sodom and Gomorrah, if I destroy the first world that existed in the time of Noah, I will also destroy this world with fire. And then God said, the key is made for the padlock. The key is made for the padlock. Food is made for the belly and the belly for food. But God shall destroy them both. God also told me that I should preach about his impending judgment, that I should tell the world that his judgment is coming. I shouldn't hide this words at all and I should raise an alarm and let the people know that the judgment of God is coming. He said, preach about my impending judgment. Tell my children that I am angry with evildoers. Tell those who are called by my name that they should depart from evil. If Tell those who are called by my name that they should depart from evil. If not, they shall have their place in the eternal lake of fire. As for the prophets and pastors who deceive my children, if they fail to change, they shall receive the highest punishment among humans in hell. This is a message the Lord gave me yesterday evening. God is not happy with the situation of this world now. It's like everything is turning upside down. The foundations are being destroyed. The righteous are being haunted. Even the church has become so unclean. The garments that the Lord has given to us, the garments of righteousness, has been soiled with worldliness and sins in the world. It pains my heart when I see Christians who are passing through this world, living as if they are inheriting this world and the beautiful things in this world, as if they have no place in heaven. It pains my heart. And I know that Jesus Christ is not happy with us. So what's in the situation, we have false prophets and false pastors, false teachers. As Jesus rightly said in Matthew chapter 24 verse 24, that in the last days there shall be false prophets and false pastors. People who will teach wrong doctrines. Today we have, there are thousands of them in the world who are destroying the world. Jesus is saying, that these pastors who are turning the world upside down, who are turning the church upside down, are making people to become lukewarm, he is going to punish them and that they will have their place in the lake of fire. That they should, their torment is going to be the highest among humans. That means after demons who rebel against God, it is going to be this among humans, pastors who do not live by the word of God but became antichrist in the church are going to face the highest level of torment so far in hell. Uh, some months ago, the Lord gave me a message which I posted. There have been lots of attacks since I posted that message. And I want to beg every Christian, please pray for me. There are messages that the Lord has given to me, but the devil is trying to destroy these messages. The attacks have increased so much. As you pray for me, I pray for you too. I'm going to leave the link of the message 
in the description box and whosoever that wants to share this message please make sure you share the link of that message too it is a serious and urgent warning from our lord jesus christ to false prophets and false pastors members of the church of jesus christ and also pastors make sure you follow your bible the antichrist is already in the world the judgment of god is coming please repent i want to beg every preacher every member of the church every christian please preach the word of god because jesus christ will come any moment from now we don't have time again let us make use of today that we can boast all we don't know what the next minute is going to bring to us jesus is going to return but unfortunately not many people are talking about this but i know and you know if you are watching you should know that jesus christ is at hand please wash your garments clean the lord is coming very soon he is not going to tarry any longer he is coming please share this message and also subscribe thank you and god bless you Bye-bye.